should never leave your stuff unattended. By now. Hey, get this on the block. Get this on the block. So the point of this is that you should never leave your booth unattended because your boat, your booth can leave you. And it's, it's your Look, they, they would have no idea their stuff is gone. Not, not. So we're here early, as always. What's going on with these two ugly folks? On this beautiful wife of mine, getting out. Your your attitude's really ugly, though. You've been giving me a lot of like a lot of a hard time. Yo, I thought you nah. were calling me ugly, bro. Nah, bro. <laughs> so we got some stuff coming in already. What is this one called? It's not called a toolbox. It's, uh, a, it's the lockbox. Lockbox. Next to a private label. We're gonna be doing buybacks consignment. I gotta get my breakfast in. Sneaker Con Champ breakfast. It's the only way I can make it through the day. It's OD and on sugar. Well, if it isn't Marky Mark in the Funky Bunch. Yeah. What's going on, bro? How you doing? Good. So the homies from Soul Action made it down from Vegas. Yeah. How was the drive, guys? It was cool. I was sleeping the whole time. Daniel and um, George were driving. So you, you were chauffeured here all the way from Vegas and you slept the entire drive. How long was the drive? 22 hours. 22, wow, you slept for 22 hours? Oh, no, so I took a little break, you know. Oh, you smoked. took a break from taking a nap. Yeah, yeah. yeah, then go back to sleep. <laughs> see what you guys got here. Oh, yeah, you like my shirt? Oh, Dom Rebel, yeah, man. I wonder where you got that from. I don't know, some I know, like store in Vegas. Some store in Vegas? Like, yeah, I think people call it the UN. Gyms are like four years before I can fit it. People call the store UN, I think. The UN, huh? Yeah. You guys got some good stuff here, man. Thank you, thank you. What's your, uh, for those that don't know, what's the IG? Uh, IG is Selection LV. Okay. And uh, we're based on Vegas, yep. So. What's good, bro? How Chilling, you doing? Man. How you been? Doing good, bro. So, uh... Just copping some heat as always. Trying. For those that might not know, he actually sold me my pastel jacket in Lauderdale. You Puerto Rican, so that's a pastel jacket. Wow. What's your IG, bro? Request Boutique, bro. Alright, no doubt. I'll make sure to get you on Is the ground. Good? Yeah, they fit great. Appreciate them. No, I appreciate you, bro. As always, throwing deals. What's going on? Um, my name's Nate. That's um, Aaron. What's um, up? Hi, everyone. And we're, um, we're opening a store in the Chicago like suburb area. It's gonna be called um, Central Hype. It's gonna have you know a ton of streetwear, sneakers. We're gonna do buy, sell, um, trade along with um, consignment. Oh. It should be opening around um, December. Yeah. December. Yeah. Like, you guys like, have an December. Instagram for it? Already? Yeah, uh, Central Hype IL. Central Hype IL. Cool. No, Central Hype IL. IL. Okay, IL. got it. Central so, Hype IL. Um, Next time I'm in Chicago, which is the next sneaker con, which is going to be a two-day event. Hopefully, yeah. you guys are yeah. open by then, and I'll come check it out. Yeah, please, sure. definitely. Awesome, yeah, please. Thank, you so Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Their sighting sees is actually shopping for stuff. <laughs> pressure's on you. Pressure's on. Now you got to buy something. Show these people you got high credit score, fam. <laughs> of course, I got a high credit score. Look, there's all those nerds. Right there are the McChickens. Alright bro, don't, don't turn this into an all day thing. Do you want to buy the shoe or not? 
gonna get something. You're yeah. gonna get something? Yeah. Do you have his? Do you have our size in those? No, I only got size ten. See, just fit it. Just put triple socket. Wear a bunch of socks. Triple. Yeah, I'll put a four suit on that thing. Cause I wear nine half. It's still fit me. All right, bro, you're killing my battery, dog. What are you gonna buy? Probably. You see, he's trying to finagle his way out of buying something, right? I'll buy something. He's trying to get off the screen. Here, let me move up, see, so it looks like you're gone. The bomb factory out of Dallas. I probably bought at least 100 pairs off my man right here. Nobody gonna do it. I really got a little god on him because he didn't tell me they was re-releasing them, or I wouldn't have bought them. Today? I mean, I knew they was coming out of Chicago. Family, what's your Instagram? The Bomb Factory. Okay. I'll make sure to put you on the vlog, bro. Please do, brother. Man, because I keep seeing this chain. Oh. <laughs> you, that officially is the world's largest vape chain, B. <laughs> it's just tough. Appreciate it, man. Where you guys from? Um, Mesquite. Okay. Let's go to sneak shop. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. We were talking on. We were talking to wifey. That's yeah. what's up, man. I used to. I used to live out there. Well, I lived in Dallas. Back in the day, but I used to work at uh, that mall. The, Tony's? Yep, used to work at Tony's. I used to be a manager at one of the uh, sneaker stores. Yeah. In the, oh, yeah? Back in the day. Yeah, I'm from Brooklyn. I, I just moved to Texas like three years ago. Okay. That's what's up. Yeah, I do restoration, custom work, and everything. Yeah? Yeah. That's what's up, B. That's the cleaner right there? Uh, this is the sauce I made. Oh, this is soul sauce. Yeah, and I, I made it myself because every, everything that was out there wasn't working for me. Okay. And I do a lot of restoration, so. This is How it. many treatments is this right here? This is 24 hours. 24 hours? Yeah. And just leaving it outside? No, I have an indoor setup. Okay. Then I do indoor because I do a lot of a lot of custom work, so I, I respond to for the customer shoes. I don't want to get stolen, so. Right. I what's your uh, What's your IG, bro? My My IG is at Hooky Kicks. Hooky H O O K Y K I K Z. Okay. And sauce is available for sale. As you can see, it works. This is one session. Yeah, that's pretty good. You know what I'm saying? We I'm got asked a lot for. For sauce. I bought it, make it myself. Tag it. Little lean bottles, bro. Yeah, that's tough, bro. It's different. Yeah, trying to catch eye. There's a little bit of the line. Hey, what's going on, bro? What's going on, everybody? How you guys doing today? What's up? What's, what's up? going on? Weren't you just in there? Oh man, I gotta look for the deals. Oh, so you out here working? Absolutely, working for you. Working for me. <laughs> well, I appreciate all the work and effort that you're putting in. The more you do, the less I do. Thank you. What's going on, guys? What's up, man? What's going on? Chillin', chillin'. Decent little line. Memphis coming out strong. Hey. What's going on, guys? Hey, guys. Hi. What's going on? This is for the YouTubes. Sweats, hats. That's crazy. This is like pretty dope. How good you got the print? Yeah, nice, it came man. out good, dude. It took. It was hard to find it. There you go, bro. So the doors just open. C's is acting like he's working. Joni is acting like she's working. So we're going. Doors just open. Hopefully, it's a good day today. We were just sleeping on the line. I didn't get a chance to see you. So I've messed with this brand called Budget, and they make shoes for kids that get murdered over shoes. And then they make the silhouettes, and then they sell it. And then half of them, she goes back to the and half of them goes and she goes to the brand. So they all look like this. They all look like models. I appreciate it. Thank you. This is me trying to ignore the fact that Joni's trying to be funny in the background and make me laugh, but we're not laughing. Ever. At any of your jokes. Because you're not funny, Joni. Yeah, you're not. I'm funny. Said no one ever. Anyways, so by now you've seen most of this video. In this video, you saw some of Memphis sneaker con I let C's handle some of the b-roll and some of the interactions you saw me prank Yeezy Buster uh, a little bit it was supposed to be Yeezy Buster and uh, Just Win that we were supposed to catch but Just Win doesn't like hanging out by his booth an entire event so would have been funny if we got both but one is better than none and um, I had one pickup at sneaker con Memphis and it was a pretty good one 
Comes with this little baggie. I can fit um, a lot of stuff in here. To hide my emotions in here. I'm gonna put them right in here, Joni. Hold on. Take them out of here, throw them in here. Yeah, I am a big bag of emotions around you because you, you all, you're always mean to me. And you always... Joni, you know how I wake up every morning? I wake up, I like stretch, I yawn, I look over, I smile. And Joni hits me with, you still lynch. Every day. Anyways, I got these. For a price that I finally felt comfortable with. Which was like three times retail. Ouch. Now, dope shoe, glad, glad I got them. Um, I went half size up because when I put my true size on, they were a little snug. But now I could I could match my wife because I can't ever have let her have more shine than me. Ever. We shine together, but we don't shine at all, right, Joni? Yes. Thought so. You better say yes. Anyways, um, sneaker. So after sneaker con. Memphis we winded up going to we met well at sneaker con Memphis we met Brennan and uh, Brennan was telling us a story about how you know he's a cancer survivor and went to St. Jude's and St. Jude's started this program where they're teaching 12 lucky people how to be doctors right but they started a PhD program at St. Jude's and on Sunday he allowed us to you know go into St. Jude's with us and he gave us like a little personal tour which was really dope so the leftover merch that we had we took to St. Jude's and we gave them we left them with uh, Brennan so he could give to some of the patients and their family members so um, felt good about that food was pretty cool out there the weather wasn't that bad and now we're back we're home for about 10 days getting ready for Black Friday we're doing a promo where if you buy a UN shirt or hoodie you will get a scratch off ticket ticket in store and 25 people are going to win Yeezys in their size so you're definitely gonna want to get here and get here early before all those shirts are gone um, you might win Yeezys and that's pretty good I think from here from Black Friday after that what else are we doing Charlie we're going to London and London's gonna be pretty dope I have the shirt somewhere somewhere around here so in Lon so at London we're gonna be dropping this shirt, um, which I kind of like, man. I, you went kind of old, super OG, right? Uh, got inspiration from a simpler time back in the day. But hopefully these will do well, and and you know I'm excited to go back to London and hang out for a little bit, and we're gonna be checking out presented by while we're there, which they man they've had so much growth since the last time I was there if you guys aren't following them make sure you follow uh, pre at presented by shop they're based out of Lon London they're on Percy Street you'll probably catch me hanging out there most of the time I'm in London to be honest man I, it's hard for me not to be around sneakers but um, you know I'm, I'm, as always I appreciate you guys watching um, you know this video is right before Thanksgiving so enjoy your Thanksgiving make sure to pass by on Black Friday and hopefully I'll see you at one of the next sneaker cons, which is London, Berlin, New York. And in between that, we're going to Dubai to Seoul DXB. And I got shirts for every one of those events. So I'll catch you guys soon.